Well, we're continuing to follow some breaking news from overnight in the city. Three separate shootings in Indy. We know one person is dead, several others injured. The most recent one happened at 38th and Capitol right before midnight. This started with a fight and then shots fire and ended after a brief police chase. Alyssa Raymond is at IMPD headquarters this morning with what we know about all these cases. Good morning, Alyssa. Julia Ben, good morning. We know police have at least one person in custody for that crime. Obviously, there could be more arrests made since it's still really early on in this investigation. But here's what we know about this one. It started between a fight between a couple people, a small group of people. Then there were shots fired. One of the people in the fight then tried to run away but was hit by a minivan driven by one of the suspects. Police actually saw this happen, saw the minivan hit the person, so they started following that minivan. After a brief chase, police stopped the van at 35th and Kenwood and arrested at least one person. Like we said, that person was in that van. Paramedics took the person that was hit by the van to Methodist in critical condition. Now, let's take a look at another shooting from overnight. This one happened around 1115 over at the Marathon gas station at East 42nd Street and North Franklin Road. A woman was shot outside of the store part of this gas station investigating the scene, trying to piece it together. Uh, from what we're gathering from the witnesses, a vehicle entered the parking lot and started shooting. We don't know if uh, she was the target or an innocent bystander. That's going to have to come out in the investigation. Paramedics took the woman to Eskenazi in critical condition. We're told the woman did have a small child in her car. That child was not hurt, and we're told family members came to get that child. The captain there that you heard from at the scene says that they're trying to get their hands on some security video from cameras that were outside of that gas station. Obviously, that could be a huge help in this investigation. Ben Julia. Alyssa, thank you very much. And as Alyssa mentioned, there were three calls that police responded to in all last night. One of them was here on Arnalda Avenue on the city's west side. Police say they found a man on the sidewalk who had been shot several times. He died at the scene. Right now, we don't know that man's name, and police are asking anyone with information to call Crime Stoppers at 262 Tips. Well, Ohio State.